Now we're going to talk about doing an NIF, Negative Inspiratory Force, or an Inspiratory Pressure Measurement. To do that, you need simply a manometer gauge and some form of mouthpiece. And this is nothing more than a manometer gauge which will read all the way up to negative 120 of pressure. The mouthpiece allows us to direct that pressure, that suction, into the manometer gauge. So when I do this on the patient, I'll have the patient put the mouthpiece here in their mouth and I'll close off both sides with my hands. Typically I'll be wearing gloves and have the patient inhale deeply. Now we want the patient to inhale using their lungs, not their jaw, tongue, and mouth muscles. So they should not go a sucking motion, but they should draw by pulling with their diaphragm and their ribs, as if they're trying to inhale deeply. So we have the patient insert the mouth piece in their mouth, leave the unit open so they can get a sense of just simply breathing and then when we're ready we have the patient draw with their lungs. As the patient inhales you want to watch the needle. Like that. Notice I reached negative 50 and typically you want to see in patients greater than a negative 20. So I'm doing okay. So repeat that several times as the patient's able. You can also remove the mouthpiece and attach this right to an endotube and test patients that have trach or endotube to see if they're ready to become weaned from the ventilator. That concludes NIF, or Negative Inspiratory Force Measurements.